So I was at Costco um, this past week, and I didn't get a whole lot from there, but I saw their um, uh, this thing of crab meat. Um, I love crab. I was always a big fan of imitation crab. That's full of sugar, though. Um, but it was a 16-ounce thing of crab, and I got it. And one of the things I've really been... I guess when I got it, one of the things I've been thinking about was the uh, at Chinese buffets. Sometimes they have like this crab bake, and they use imitation crab, and it's got like a like a mayonnaise, sour cream, cream cheese stuff in it, and then celery that I always pick out and stuff and cheesy. Um, and that sounded really good, so I decided to try to make it. I did not put the celery in because I don't like it. Um, I did still use some cabbage, um, but anyway, that's what I'm eating right now. I think it's delicious. Sadie in the video will say that she likes it, but that big bite she took um, was too big of a bite for her, I believe. Um, but I like it a lot. I think it tastes really close to what I was trying to do, so here's how I made it. All right, here's my crab casserole. Let's see what it tastes like. It tastes kind of like what I was going for. That's good. Honestly, I don't know if I'm a big fan of the celery in it. I know, or not the celery, the cabbage. I know I don't like the um, celery in it, so I intentionally left it out. I did put some cabbage. I like cabbage, so it's still pretty good in it, but I like it better without the crunch, I think. But this is pretty spot on for what I was going for. Look at the camera. Good. You like it? Mm -hmm. Take another bite. Is that good? Mm-hmm. 